This video will show you how to replace the carburetor on your Champion 338 or 389 cc engine on your pressure washer or log splitter. Always turn off your engine and let it completely cool before working on your unit. Ensure that the fuel valve and engine switch are in the off positions. Remove the spark plug cap and always leave it disconnected while working on your unit. Step 1. Locate the reversal valve pipe that connects the air cleaner and fuel tank. Loosen the clip and disconnect the pipe from the fuel tank. Step 2. Remove the two screw caps on top of the air cleaner. Carefully lift and remove the cover, and keep the carbon canister in place if your unit is equipped with one. Then locate the support bolt behind the air cleaner and remove it with a 10mm socket. Step 3. Remove the throttle lever cap. Step 4. Locate the two flange nuts on the air cleaner base and remove them with a 10mm socket. Then slide the air cleaner partway off the studs and detach the breather tube, and then fully remove the air cleaner and gasket from the studs. Step 5. Use a pair of pliers to loosen the clip, then remove the fuel line from the carburetor. Step 6. Carefully disconnect the throttle return spring. Slide the carburetor partway off the studs, Rotate the pivot arm and lift upwards to remove the governor rod, then slide the carburetor fully off the studs along with the old gasket. Step 7. Ensure that the spark plug wire is fitted into the insulator. Always use new gaskets, then slide the new carburetor partway onto the studs. Rotate the pivot arm and replace the governor rod, followed by the throttle return spring, and then slide the carburetor fully onto the studs. Now follow these steps in reverse to complete the installation. Replace the fuel line and secure the clip. Replace the gasket, reattach the breather tube to the air cleaner, and slide the air cleaner base onto the studs. Tighten the two 10mm nuts, and replace the throttle lever cap. Tighten the air cleaner support bolt, and make sure the rubber hose underneath the cover fits into the hole on the foam filter before replacing the air cleaner cover and securing the screw caps. Then reattach the reversal valve pipe and secure with the clip. And lastly, firmly reattach the spark plug cap. Your carburetor replacement is complete. Always follow the safety guidelines in your operator's manual. And for more help guides, visit the Champion Help Center at help.championpowerequipment.com.